toll that the pandemic is taking on small businesses is well known. We're once again joined this Monday morning by Brian Kelly. He's the president of the Small Business Association of Michigan. Brian, good morning. Good morning, Meredith. Great to be with you again. Well, Brian, ABC News is reporting about 2.2 million small business loans have been approved so far as part of the federal government's Paycheck Protection Program. What are you seeing in Michigan as far as businesses being able to get their loans processed? Well, it's going better than it did last time. The first time we saw bigger companies, in some cases still small business, small businesses, but bigger small businesses, they were just better positioned to go in there and get the Paycheck Protection Program forgivable loans. And uh, in this round, the average size loan that has made it through is much, much smaller, which means that they tend to be the smaller businesses. So we're pleased with that, that the, the truly small companies seem to be getting through better this time than before. And it is certainly needed. Absolutely. Well, how much longer, Brian, do you think that this can last before we see a large number of businesses close for good? Well, we surveyed our members uh, a little more than a week ago, and we asked them just that question, how long can you hold on? And 4% of our members said, we think we're really already out of business. Another 10% said that, uh, that they're skeptical that they're gonna be able to survive this. So those who really don't think they're gonna be able to make it already, about 14% of our members. And we've got 28,000 members, so that's a very significant number. So uh, what, one thing that we do know for sure is the longer that this goes on, the, the higher that number gets of the, of the business failures, the ones who simply won't be able to hold on any longer. Now, Brian, I also want to ask you about the protests at the Capitol last week. You spent a lot of time there uh, as Lieutenant Governor. What did you think when you saw the video and images of the protesters inside the Capitol? Well, it's nothing I haven't seen before. And keep in mind, I was uh, in the House of Representatives for for four years and then uh, and then eight years as lieutenant governor. And I saw small protests and huge protests. I've seen protests that, that dwarf the size of that one. Uh, we, we have seen uh, the, the police crowd control out before and the um, in the open carry protesters around. So um, I know they're, they're certainly dramatic images, but when you've been around there at the Capitol for more than a decade like I had, it wasn't anything that uh, that that I hadn't seen on multiple, multiple occasions. Well, Brian, thank you so much for joining us this morning. We'll look forward to speaking with you again next Monday. Thanks, Meredith.